first class to satisfy my curiosity has evolved into something that defines who I am and what I do. The fact is that chess has allowed me to meet so many diverse yet like-minded individuals both in Singapore and overseas. Chess has also taught me two things. It has taught me how to experience satisfaction after overcoming a trial involving four hours of grueling work. At the same time, it has taught me how to be crushed, but gave me a chance to bounce back and become a better person. If chess has taught me one thing, it's that no success, but at the same time no failure will last. And it is up to you to internalize what you did right and what you did wrong, and to improve as a person. This is not to say that the game's effects are limited to the tournament hall, however. One thing that I find really amazing is that so many of my friends around me are actually picking up the game. The fact that so many people in this school are learning chess, it really does put a smile on my face because it shows just how well chess can connect people across the board and around the world. applying uh, what they have been learning and um, so I think what fires me up as a teacher is actually looking for activities, tasks that I hope will enthuse students and uh, be meaningful you know for them. Uh, one of the most uh, interesting things It is very rich in biodiversity and most of the habitat and ecosystem actually have been learned and taught in the class. So, um, do you have any tips for people who want to find their passion, such as you? Yeah, there's lots of things that make me happy. Um, you know, herpetology is just one of them. And I think it helps to um, think about what makes you happy rather than what, uh, what, like worrying about what your true passion is and not being able to find it. That's quite inspiring for someone such as myself. Here's another fun bit of information. The siren. that you hear, calling to Elsa, is based on the Norwegian calling or shepherding call. That is, Elsa, home to the enchanted forest where she eventually decides to stay. You know what happened with the D.R. 